hello guys welcome once again this is tech pba thanks for joining me so in this video we'll look at how to customize your control center on your iphones running ios version 18 and later so on previous ios versions um, if you wanted to customize your control center you would go to settings by tapping on it on the settings app and then tapping on control center from there you you would have seen all the controls there to add to or remove from your control center but ios version 18 and later is not like that so you can see that um, you are giving some animation on how to do it right there um it's different from how it's done on the earlier versions of the so to customize it you need to flip down your screen in the direction of the arrow as shown and then you would see your control center so these are by default the controls there to add to it or to customize the control center tap on the plus sign at the left the top left of your screen and then from here you can remove from the control center by tapping on the the dashes on top of the controls so if you tap on the dash you would remove a control from the control center but to add to the control center you would need to tap the add a control command down there and then from there you would see all the controls that you can um, you can add to your control center so i'll tap on the that to add to it the screen recording uh, control and you can see that it's been added successfully i will also tap on the um, recognize music control and then there you, you have it it's been added to the control center and then i'll add one more thing which is the um orientation lock i'll add and you can see that it has also been added there so if you don't want your phone to be changing orientation by itself um you can add that control to um, enable and disable it as and when you need it so that those are all the controls you can add to your control center there are quite quite a lot of them so there's one more control i would love to add to my control center on this very iphone which is the um, assistive touch so you can see that it's also been added successfully right there so yes guys once you're done just tap on any empty space in the control center to save your changes so yes guys we've looked at how to customize the control center on ios 18.0 and later so kindly click on the subscribe button down this video to subscribe and support us to bring you more of such videos click the like if you the like button if you enjoyed this video um turn on notifications for all share the video and then i'll see you in another video bye